Today, we commemorate one of the most important days in the history of the Utah National Guard. The 213th Field Artillery Battalion, comprised of 600 soldiers from Southern Utah, with batteries based in Fillmore, Richfield, Beaver, Cedar City, and St. George, was activated to fight in the Korean War. On May 26, 1951, batteries of that battalion, numbering 240, were confronted with a brigade strength element of Chinese infantry, 4,000 men. The Utah Guardsmen, who had excelled in their training and who followed an outstanding leader, met the onslaught with close fire artillery, repelled the invaders, and chased after the retreating column, which resulted in the capture of 830 enemy, killing 350, while not one Utah Guard soldier fell, not one. This is one of the most dramatic victories in our military history. Today, we honor those soldiers, most of whom are no longer with us. We salute them, we thank them for their service and sacrifice. Their example is a testament to the importance of training, preparation, and leadership. That is what made the difference then. That is what educates and inspires the new generation of warriors who serve today. Those brave soldiers from Southern Utah, called up to defend freedom, will never be forgotten. 600 soldiers were called up and deployed to Korea, 600 returned home alive. We thank the people of Kapyong for the beautiful memorial to commemorate that battle and to the memory of our soldiers. We thank you, you have honored us, and we will remember it.